All righty, welcome back. Let's get things rolling after this morning and overall pretty quiet across the Rhinelander area. Some people already traveling as we get things started after this morning. We're going to be watching for some sunshine coming out soon. For now, we're starting off with just a little bit of cloud cover across the region. And don't let this fool you, though. We will see the clouds breaking up throughout the daytime period today to reveal just a little bit of sunshine and decent sunshine in some spots as well. Let's zoom things out and give you the kind of the bigger picture, though. So we have a front right about in here that's starting to track through now as it tracks through the clouds will begin to get out of here as well. High pressure may get some control going for at least a little while yet. Now will give us some sunshine in some spots, but the clouds may hold on in other areas. Future Cat's kind of showing some of the clouds that will get out of here today. Mainly along the north of Rhinelander, though, might hold on to the clouds while areas to the south, though, will see a good amount of sunshine. And depending on how much sunshine you get, temperatures may rebound pretty decently. Middle to upper 30s, perhaps even some lower 40s in a few spots. Or further off towards the north, if you hold on to the clouds, they will be a little bit cooler in those areas. Then everyone gets back into the clouds as we head towards the early 30s. Thursday morning and most of Thursday will stay dry. In fact, all of Thursday will stay dry. Futurecast trying to get some precipitation going. I'm not sold on that right now. I'm more believing the, the mostly cloudy sky and dry uh, idea. And then by Thursday night to Friday morning, still dry. But Friday itself, I'll have to watch for a few chances for a little bit of rain. But for now, though, we do have winds up to around 15 miles per hour possible today. Maybe some gusts tonight up to 20 to 25 miles per hour at times. And those are wind gusts, not the sustained winds. These are wind gusts we're talking about here. Then we'll get the wind gusts up to around 20 to 25 miles per hour Thursday morning and still some gusts up to 15 to 20 miles per hour as we head towards Thursday evening. Temperatures right now starting off in the lower 20s, so starting to rebound in a few spots now. Even some lower 20s in Rhinelander and also in Tomahawk. Farther down to the south, though, seeing some temperatures that are in the middle to upper 20s there. As our average high temperature is around 26 degrees, though, we'll do middle 30s, even upper 30s, to Wednesday, Thursday, and a Friday. Then lower 40s Saturday. And here we go, Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. Here we go, Sunday and also into Monday. Very warm though with again middle 40s and some rain chances by Monday as well so definitely an unusual Christmas this year then upper 30s as we head towards Tuesday so with all this in mind keep the ice thickness in mind again you want at least four inches of ice for it to be deemed safe to be out and about while ice fishing anything below that three inches or less I would definitely discourage that but of course as we get more ice and good uh, and good ice so really it'll be okay to bring out the stuff out but for now four inches of ice at least be safe to walk on but we're we're trying to hold on to our snow as well just barely an inch in the right area, maybe a little bit more in the UP areas, but unfortunately a lot of this will be melting. Middle 30s today, partly cloudy, with the east wind getting up to about 5 to 10 miles per hour. Overnight tonight, here we go, lower 20s, increasing clouds, and that southeast wind getting up to about 5 to 10 miles per hour. Northwoods furniture and mattress, seven-day forecast. So we're dry Thursday, first day of winter, mostly cloudy temperatures in the mid-30s. There's chances for rain on Friday, not a strong chance, but a little bit of a chance, with highs in the upper 30s. Then Saturday and Sunday, we're dry, mostly cloudy temperatures in the 40s, and here we go. Christmas Day and Tuesday, rain chances, temperatures in the 30s and 40s.